your career and technical education back when I was in high school was called vocational education. It wasn't elaborate as it is today. So over the last 20 some years, we have evolved from a shop class and a home ec class in each school to programs now that from the wide range of um, technology classes, trades classes, with whether it's uh, welding, um, cosmetology, nail tech, child care, culinary. The thing I like most is that it's not just learning in the classroom, you get to be active and actually like what we did today with uh, learning forensics and stuff, uh, dealing with fingerprints, that's definitely a good part about this class that I really enjoyed. Simple core classes, they teach you, they just teach you things that they think that you need to know. Entrepreneurship education actually helps you with your future, with your actual life and your career, it helps you build a career. It's one of those career classes. Not all, only are we offering programs that lead to career pathways, we offer credentials that the students are able to obtain before they graduate. In a total of all of our programs, we had over 1,200 certifications that students earned this past spring. Portsmouth is kind of unique in that it's a small area geographically. So we can move students around from different high schools that we maybe have programs that are in, say, Manor, Norcom, or Churchland. We outnumber a lot of other school districts. And while they had a lot of our programs, the size of the programs was not as big as ours. We actually have a, a $1.3 million culinary program that we put over at Manor High School about 15 years ago. It's amazing when you go and see something and then when you come back home and how much you appreciate what you have in your own district. We have all these things here where students are able to take advantage of. So are there some avenues and things that we want to improve and add? Of course. I've never really used like the big mixers, which is a lot of fun because they're different. I've never used like a conventional oven, so that's different. Pastry blenders, never used a pastry blender before, and it's made me realize that I've actually wanted to do this for a long time. After I graduated, I've always wanted to go to culinary school, and then I've always wanted to own my own bakery. But ever since I was little, I've been interested in hair, and doing my own hair, it made me found more passion for it. Well, my plan is to open a salon in multiple areas across the country. But what we have are opportunities for students to go into any career path that they choose. And when you have opportunities, the sky's the limit. The exclamation is, what are you going to do after high school? And we're trying to provide some of those explanations.